Hello, everyone. My name is Philip Simpson, and I'm the Director of Student Affairs for the School of Nursing. And I want to welcome you to the virtual SOAR nursing interest session. Uh, the goal of this session is to go over a few of the items of uh, what to expect coming up at SOAR. So first off, um, want to make sure everyone understands as you come in to pursue nursing at UNCG, you will be listed as a pre-health major assigned with the School of HHS, which is Health and Human Sciences. Uh, the goal here is to, uh, you know, split the advising duties across both the School of Nursing and the Health and Human Sciences, partly because um, there's a large number of you that come in each year. And so uh, Health and Human Sciences has been a great partner over the years uh, simply because they're a school that has several different health-related majors uh, that they offer. So it's been, again, a good working relationship. And they're right across our uh, yard here at our front door. So one thing to also keep in mind is you're going to come in and be registered for several courses for your first semester. And as you know, probably already know, there are several requirements that must be met in order to get into the School of Nursing. Um, the key is to get these courses added to your schedule each semester and make sure that you get off to a good start with Principles of Biology, which is Biology 111 plus the lab. That course is a prerequisite for several of the other um, biology courses that you'll be taking later on, such as anatomy, uh, physiology, microbiology, some of you will also be taking chemistry either this fall or in the spring. Um, in addition to those courses, there's other courses such as lifespan development, psychology, um, nutrition. You'll be taking those along the way. The key is to make sure you stay on top of these courses so you are on track in order to apply to the program. Now, that application process, um, since we are in upper division, that will take place halfway through your sophomore year you will apply by February 1st of your sophomore year. And we encourage you to have uh, strong credentials. It's a very competitive um, admission process. We have um, told students over the past to, you know, aim for a 3.6 GPA or higher. You also wanna have strong grades in your sciences. And there's also a pre-admission test called the T's. And you'll learn about that um, at a later time. You won't take that T's exam until your sophomore year, right before you apply. So don't rush out and do it now. Uh, once you're in the program, you may, some of you may not realize um, bachelor of science programs or any nursing program that's a pre-licensure program, um, including associate's degree in nursing. Um, you know, they also have uh, diploma programs for nursing, but our BSN programs, like all others in the country, prepare you to be a general nurse. So when you graduate from UNCG, you do not specialize. Um, you have to be a generalist and you're gonna go through all these different areas of nursing. Uh, the reason for that is because you have to be able to um, pass the licensing exam, which is known as the NCLEX. So the NCLEX is gonna test your knowledge in all these different areas of nursing. So again, you will leave here as a generalist. Now, uh, one thing to also mention, and I hope you already have uh, realized this, is that you have a brand new building at your disposal. Um, we have a new state-of-the-art facility we've been waiting for for quite some time. Uh, I have to tell you, it is absolutely beautiful. Uh, wait till you see some of the simulation space in this building, you will be um, absolutely amazed. So I want to uh, welcome you and uh, we are certainly glad you're here. We look forward to working with you and please reach out to us if you have any questions or concerns. You can find our contact information on this slide. Uh, make sure you visit our website. We have a um, BSN information um, guide out there. We also have some sample plans of study. Uh, we'd like you to make use of those tools as you're planning out your semesters to come. Um, once again, welcome. I look forward to working with you and we will see you soon.